Hello my loves and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I am doing another quick review of the I'm From Rice Mask. This is a natural based rice mask with actual real chunks of rice granulars in it and the actual shells to it. This mask is designed to brighten the skin, firm the skin by adding loads of nutrients, and also exfoliate and deeply moisturize the skin. So today I'm going to be sharing my personal experience with this product with you guys. And right off the bat, I can say I absolutely loved the texture of this product. It was just somehow so satisfying to use. It's like a really dense cream, but when you apply it to the skin, it kind of has this really cooling and melty texture to it that leaves your skin feeling extremely hydrated and moisturized. Alongside the moisture texture, it has so many granulars and chunks in it that when you apply it, you can literally feel it exfoliating when you just lightly brush it over your skin. Now, aside from the actual texture of the product, when it comes to the ingredients and the formulation itself, I did have a few problems with this mask, and that is the fact that it has a number of different types of alcohols in it, which is something to be concerning for me as someone with really sensitive acne prone skin. Too many alcohols in a product have had a bad track record on my skin and have broken me out or caused me irritation. Second to that, the one thing I noticed immediately when I opened this product is that it has a really strong fragrance. And for me, that's a big no, an absolute big no. It has a really strong floral perfumey smell, which I'm not a fan of at all. Aside from that, all the rest of the ingredients are totally fine. So I figured I'd give it a shot. So you're supposed to apply this mask on your skin, then rub it in to get an exfoliating effect. Then after you rub it in, you can leave it on for five minutes to let it do what it has to do. For me, I did not make it to the five minute mark because this mask started to feel itchy and somewhat tingly on my skin, which is a big red flag for me. So I removed it about after two to three minutes of sitting on my face after exfoliating. And I like to always remove it with a tissue and a sponge that is damp with water then rinse it off um, fortunately for me I did not get any breakouts after using it but I'm still a little bit iffy on if it will with continual use or not let me know if you guys use this product and if it's broken you out or given you irritation for me I'm lucky that it didn't yet but it's hard to say but my did my skin felt so soft and extremely moisturized after like it felt really good after it's just that fragrance and that tingling was a bit concerning so if you guys want to see more of my detailed opinion on this i have a full in-depth blog post review down in the description box below and if you want to check out the product for itself the link to the product page will be there also i love you guys so much and i'll see you next time